Hey guys, welcome to All Street Comics Off Topic. We're your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. Also known as David Clark. And Walter Bryan. And today we're talking about Attack on Titan, Chapter 50. Right? It's an all manga episode. Wait, just Chapter 50? I mean, because, you know, they probably want to know about what happened between, like, 35 and 50, nah. considering that, you know, we, uh, we stopped around, like, 35. Alright, go ahead. Explain everything in five seconds. Go. Okay. Aaron is awesome. Yeah, all right, cool. So now, they're at a... Well, Aaron got kidnapped. Um, again, that, that seems to be his thing. <laughs> By the, uh, the Colossal and the Armor, who... Um, spoiler alert. We know at this point are Annie... Or, no, sorry. Not Annie. Bert Holt and Reiner, yeah. who are in cahoots with Annie. And, you know, like, they, they do all these little flashbacks and stuff about Aaron's life. And it turns out, pretty much his entire life... He's been getting beat up or kidnapped and getting his butt saved by Mikasa. Yeah, which is probably why he's like, don't serve me, even though you're really hot. Like, even his mom <laughs> goes, did you get beat up again and Mikasa have to come save you? And he's like, yeah, yeah, it was. And then the the the, 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 um, the guy who saved him in the first episode, in the first issue, yeah. he's like, yeah, you're always getting your butt kicked and Mikasa has to come save Basically, you. Basically, yeah. So, yeah, yeah that's a, that seems to be his uh, most right. operandi. Oh, also, you're married to Titan. Well, yeah, but we, we, don't, we'd already... We'd already I, I, don't, I don't know. That. I don't know if we had... We told him that. I mean, I know we, we probably did, but I don't know if we mentioned it in, in the manga episode. That's probably true. We probably Yeah, Ymir's a little weird, freaky titan who was human... No, she was a titan for like 60 years and then figured out how to become a human. So yeah, that. What's that. What's that thing on Ben 10, the, the, the fixed goblin? Uh, I don't know. But I don't know what you're talking about, right? But yeah, she looks like that. Kind of, yeah. Without, without clothes. In a bald spot, like right here. <laughs> it's like you look more like a man. This is kind of creepy. Um, yeah, with fangs. Yeah, but uh, so basically, they're the the military police and the survey corps go out to, or sorry, not the military police, the garrison, the non terrible people. Whatever Aaron's friend, soldier dude, <laughs> was part of the the non unicorn guys. They go out with the survey corps to go try and get Aaron back. Um, then there's like some fighting or whatever. Then the then a bunch of titans start coming. Because uh, uh, Erwin uh, brought them because he'd just be doing that. Then uh, Armored Titan starts chucking Titans at people, which is uh, pretty actually pretty cool to watch. <laughs> yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing that in, 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 when we uh, finally get to yeah. the anime. But like, yeah, the the whole chucking Titans and stomping the stomping the soldiers and you know, like they basically are pointing out the fact that they're letting all these people die just to get Aaron back. Yeah. And most of them don't even know why. They're just like, oh, okay, I'm just going out here and dying. <laughs> they're like, yeah, Aaron is uh, Aaron is the key to us saving the future. Really? Why? Well, he's the key to a basement, which might hopefully save the future. Because <laughs> how embarrassing would it be like you go down there and it's just like Aaron's dad's porn. <laughs> he's just like, this is super important, son. You need to make sure this is safe. <laughs> they get down there they're like, wow. This whole series was for nothing. But anyways, oh, Erwin loses his arm. It gets bitten off by a titan. And then everyone gets ready to turn around and go save him. He's like, keep going. I'm like, wow, how much of a man need to be? Your arm is currently in a titan's mouth. You're like, I'll be fine. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, they, they are really the best of the best. They really I mean, are, period. yeah. They, you know, like, you've got a world full of, of um, punks and, and them. Yeah. So I mean, not really full of punks because there's only like 5 million people left on the planet. If but, that, if that. Yeah. And then they keep wiping them out. They're like, hey, we got old people. Less than a million of them out. Yeah, so... Not up for everybody, I guess. Except for the really fat people in the center. <laughs> because, you know, hey. Yeah. <laughs> who, are, who are surrounded by Titans. Yeah. Oh, they don't know that yet. Oh, yeah. Walls are t full of Titans. But we told you that before. Um, so, anyways. Uh, now, there's one There's one point during the uh, during the chaos where they finally get uh, Aaron back. Armin basically walks up to the armored Titan's face and starts talking smack. Like, hey, do you guys know that we're torturing Annie right now? We're getting all the info out of her. It's, it's awesome. And they're like... No way! He's like, uh, uh, uh. you know, throw him up the game, whatnot. Then uh, the smiling Titan, the one that ate Aaron's mom, makes an appearance. And as some of our commenters have said, it is not Armin. Well, no, because he's a uh, he's off somewhere on the else other side with with John. Like, talking. hey, yeah. stop dying! Stop dying! <laughs> You're being lazy right now. <laughs> so, yeah, you know, the, and the cool thing, the cool thing um, going on here, I think, aside from the fact that, well, we're beginning to get a little more information going on, um, we also are beginning to see why everybody finds Aaron so important. Yeah, because, oh, first of all, there's there's, there's one moment which is really kind of like surreal. You see, uh, 
Aaron and uh, Mikasa are in the middle of a bunch of Titans. And Mikasa just loses hope. She's like, yeah. Yeah, I mean, we're out, we're out in the middle of the open. Yeah. You can't turn into a Titan. So, basically... Let's get it on before we die. Yeah, well, I don't know. But she does. She does. She doesn't say that quite. She much. was getting ready to. She, she was all like, "Well, you know." Uh, she's all blushing, like you are. Know, just blah blah blah. It was nice. Blah, she blah, blah. just told him she was in love with him. Basically. Yeah, she's and, like, I, "I'm happy that I'm going to die with you." And Aaron was like, "You know what? Nah." I, I think Aaron was like, "You know what? Now the way I was talking about, she's really hot. <laughs> like I want this to happen." So he turns around. Keep in mind, no, no hands still. And punches the Titan in the hand and also learns to control Titans. Yeah, that, pretty much. That's how far men are willing to go for a hot woman. They will gain the ability to control monsters with their very mind. <laughs> like, well, well, before that, though, he, he's sitting there and as Mikasa tells him how awesome as just being with him is at that moment, he goes, you know what? Nah. Nah. Yeah. I want some more of this. Yeah, exactly. I, want, I, I am going to have that. Right. That is that. that this, is, like, this is happening. I want more because of where she's not being the man in the relationship. <laughs> <laughs> then he turns around, punches yeah. the other Titan, and right. then just they, which shows why they wanted Aaron because he could control Titans. And uh, as some people pointed out on the interwebs, this is probably why the other Titans attacked Aaron in Titan form because other Titan shifters don't get attacked unless they draw attention. But Aaron's subconscious need to kill Titans, always saying "fight me," blah, blah blah, is probably why they were always drawn to him immediately from the start, without him having to roar or anything. So you know, he's probably it may all just be his fault. All those fights. <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> everything else is his fault. Why yeah. can't why can't that? But be now, hey, now at least he can control the walls. Which someone like Aaron is probably why the walls were formed. Because you're not going to just get those Titans to just form a gigantic circle that quick and form walls. Maybe you could. With what? Like tacos? You, 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 you just bribe them with Taco, tacos? Tacos are great, dude. They are great. I mean, look. But they don't like tacos. They like humans. Beast Boy and Beast Boy and, um, and Cyborg had an entire episode of war over tacos. Yeah, but they don't, they don't eat... And burgers. They don't eat humans just for the fun of it, though. What about human tacos? So, oh, no, no, no. <laughs> these, these people are scummy. They might actually do that. I, I you know, hey. So, it was either... This is our, theory, our official offshoot comics theory. It was either someone like Aaron who had the ability, because, I mean, he, remember, he was given that ability with a shot, so mm-hmm. someone who was given that shot, probably someone in Aaron's granddad's people, or they were bribed with human tacos. This is our serious theory. Now, if the taco thing comes to pass, I may have to drop the manga. <laughs> <laughs> I, may, I may have to drop it. Um, but, yes, that's, that's why Aaron's so important. And now, like, I've heard some people say that maybe they're trying to capture Aaron because... They wanted to um, use him to end the whole Titan threat, but it's like, yeah, you don't do that by kicking a hole in the city and destroying everybody. Unless you're trying to weed out the weak humans, which that kind of did. Well, we've lost some strong ones though, some really cool people. We, we've lost a, a, a whole lot of strong ones, but the strongest are still around. True, and Annie, and Annie, who we, we, should, we should really keep her around. Yeah, like. Okay, we've already seen that um, Titans can have a change of heart. But for whatever reason, apparently, if they have a change of heart, they also have to forget who they are. You think? Well, I mean, think about it. I mean, when, um, when um, was it, Reinhold, Reinhold, um, uh, Reiner and, Reiner, Reiner, Reiner and Reiner Bertholdt. Bertholdt? Yeah. yeah. Reinhold. And, Reiner. <laughs> That's the Dragon Ball Z fusion. <laughs> when, they were, when they were discussing um, the fact that they were they were kind of getting to become more human and, mm-hmm. and um, becoming part of the group. They were showing that they kind of didn't remember things about what they had done in the past. Mm-hmm. And then, you know, it's the same thing with, what's her name? Um, Ymir. Yeah, Ymir. Where, for whatever reason, to live among humans, she kind of forgot. She like she knew she was a titan, mm-hmm. but she kind of forgot some of the things she's done in the past. Well, it's probably because of, like, so, having fun. Like, yeah, normal life where I'm not eating people. This is pretty cool. Normal life where you're getting eaten. So hey, it's no, not but, quite yeah, that but, but you're cool. getting eaten, but you know that you could just bust out. I mean, like, it's not that... Sc- I mean, like, life is not scary when you're, like, a Hulk. <laughs> it's really not. And no one knows you're a Hulk. But she's the She-Hulk, though. Oh, so she's severely weaker. Yeah, I mean, we've seen that. I mean, like... <laughs> but she's, she's fast, though. She's fast. She was riding on the Armor Titan's back talking about, We're gonna die! We're gonna die! I'm gonna help out a little bit. But we're gonna die! Well, I mean, you're just riding and the Armor Titan's, Titan's like, 
I'm gonna kick the crap out of everybody and just keep going because I mean, he's close though. He's close. He was close to dying. He's he not, was close. He's not, he was. he's not looking good right now. But uh, so basically, that's what's going on right now. Um, I'm happy Armin's not the smiling titan because that would have been a really big d bag move. <laughs> Actually, I was kind of hoping he was the smiling titan. Uh huh. For and more betrayal. Yeah, well, we yeah, have more betrayal, but, but also. Then we're gonna assume everyone in Aaron's group is a titan then. Yeah. Except for Mikasa, who doesn't need to be a titan. She's a titan by herself. The, without the, being a titan. The human titan. <laughs> but uh, so yeah, that's what's going on right now. She's gonna turn out to be the monkey titan. Ah uh, no! Please, God no! <laughs> God no! That's so wrong. <laughs> that's that's like, no. That's it, it's a dude. But then again, your mirror, be. your mirror. But then again, your mirror might be a dude too. I don't know. Your mirror. You well, she, she, she's in love with Krista. She never shows any feminine traits, and she's kind of always like just sitting in the corner by herself. But she's kind of cute though. Kind of. If she's a girl, <laughs> or she's Japanese. Well, okay, <laughs> just even in the coolest mangas I've ever read, with the exception of Goku, why do all the heroes seem gay? Because in Japan, the girlier you look as a man, the more attractive you are to girls and more powerful you are. I mean, like Goku is manly and was His after voice a woman. He's a little girl though. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> But but he was after a girl pretty much the entire series, until he and then he married her and then he goes home gets her pregnant and, and leaves. leaves or dies. They're still leaving. Yeah. So, okay. <laughs> he chose to die. <laughs> he does. He chooses to die sometimes. Yeah. Like, like during cell. It's yeah. like you didn't have to. What? We could just give you a zinzu bean. No, yeah, no, no, no. I'm good. No, I'm, no, I'm good. No, I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> but um, yeah, but a, a lot of the characters in Japan are always. Girly. And it's getting worse. Like they're getting girlier and girlier. And they don't want to see like hot naked chicks. They're all like some of them do. So, like fan service animes. Like uh, I couldn't be a hero or whatever. Even he, like he sees hot naked chicks, but even he is kind of like, oh, your modesty type. Like, like, no, you know, no, they're no, hot. no, no, they're hot, and they apparently remember, don't care remember, what you're looking the at. The bigger, them. the bigger their boobs, and the less clothes they're wearing, the more powerful and relevant to the plot they are. Yeah, well, that then the demon chick is going to be really, really powerful. <laughs> but yeah, so that's what's going on Titan right now. And like we said, the more time or the more Titan manga comes out, the more we'll do videos. Uh, now we were going to do an anime uh, that we were going to follow this se season, um, but they all sucked. Yeah, the clo the the only even slightly decent two were the new Gundam series, Gundam and that's only, and and that's only, only fighting, only because of the fights, and then. Um, I couldn't be a hero, so I decided to get a job, which is okay. But I just don't. We just don't see no. that we should follow it. No. You know, like you get around to it, watch it. It's an okay anime, but, but it's not. What we will do is play a few seconds of fights from Gundam Build Fighters, so you can see how awesome it is. Awesome, right? <laughs> uh, if you guys have any suggestions on animes that we maybe missed or didn't give a fair enough shot, just let us know in the comments and we'll, we'll, we'll give it a shot and try and follow it. Yeah, but do us a favor and make sure that it hasn't gotten past like episode four. Yeah. Or if it, if, if it is, make sure it's really, really worth it. Like, not like Log Horizon, which is basically sort of online with magic, which is basically dot hack. So. Yeah, which is basically. You know, we've seen all the yeah. before. Um, but now, I heard Sword Art Online Season 2 is starting in the winter. We will follow that one, because that's Gun Gale Online, which is going to be cool. 
that's the they use guns now different game because they haven't learned the lesson from previous two online games which turned out terrible all right then yeah <laughs> so but yeah if you have any ideas let us know um now as far as arrow and ends of shield go we will be reviewing those only on the gigantic monumental episodes yeah like so next like, week with black canary yeah like when black canary or when the flash finally shows up or if and when a Hulk episode of Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. shows up. Or Coulson's Division, because... Yeah, we expect both of these things. Yeah, because that if you watch this week's episode, um, his little agent who could see, like, through crap, after the end of the episode, uh, she's like, what did they do to Coulson? And she's like, what do you mean? Like, they did something to him. <laughs> and I'm like, ah, it's like, he's... Clearly, clearly, something is up. Something well, is I mean, up. They, they have these theories uh, that maybe he was brought back by magic, which might bring in, you know, Doctor Strange. All right. Or that he is a life model decoy, which seems to be the prevailing one. It might be magic, because he keeps saying it's a magical place. Yeah. <laughs> so, I don't know. Maybe, I mean, cause isn't Strange getting a movie, too, pretty soon? Doctor Strange is supposed to get a movie, but he's supposed to be phase three, not phase two. Oh, so he's, he's, he's way So, he's, he's way, way off. Like he's, like, two or three or four years like away. Like, 2020. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, well... It could be magic. Um, isn't technically the Tesseract or the Cosmic Cube some sort of magic? Because it, it could bring people back from the dead, too. It's so, supposed well, to... how Winter, Winter Soldier is going to happen. Yeah, it's supposed to be, like, um, some kind of magic, but... Um, well, we as we know, Asgardian technology basically passes for magic, so... Wait, is, is, is the cube always been Asgardian? Or do they just keep it? No. The cube actually, uh, I think, originally was created by AIM. Really? Yeah. Oh, Good job, Modoc. <laughs> and then they decided, hey, this thing is awesome. We'll just keep it. Which didn't go over well with Hydra. No. And started a war. The Cosmic Cube War? Well, <laughs> Cosmic War. But So basically, that's what's going on with everything. Um, like I said, if anything you want us to follow, let us know. We will, we will give it a shot. Um, we're getting ready to possibly be going on hiatus pretty soon. <laughs> because... November's coming up very fast. Yeah, and we have a lot of things we have to we get We have ready Long for. Beach Comic Con to get ready for. And uh, obviously PS4, which when that comes out, we'll be doing so many videos. So many videos on PS4. Yeah, and uh, um, WWE 2K14. No, that's not, he doesn't care about that's that. That's not happen. But I, I just wanted to give it a shout out on our video. Is, is, there, is, there, is there a trailer for it? Yeah. Okay, because I played Gundam Bill of Fires. Well, we'll play a couple seconds of this trailer. next time we've been your host kirby kid and black superman see you later guys hey guys don't forget to like favorite subscribe and share our videos like crazy that's right because we love you we want you to love us and we want to keep making videos for you and keep leaving us comments we love comments yes and we answer comments unlike some of the other guys we'll get out there we'll answer and if you uh, have a great comment we'll make a video about it and if you have a not so great comment we will try to address that issue <laughs> <laughs> but uh thanks Till next time, you've been your host, Kirby Kid. And Black Superman. See you later, guys. The animes have filled this city. Yeah, all day. <laughs>